Should I tuck in my shirt? I look a little tacky. No, you look fine. <laughs> Hey, what's up, guys? Eric Ramos, Thomas Pulaski's here. Um, on, I'm. You said what's going on? <laughs> <laughs> go ahead, go ahead, go ahead. It's all right. Keep it, keep it. We just want to talk a little bit about uh, the current market, the real estate market, and a lot of people are wondering if they could buy, if they can sell, and some people are scared to buy or to sell, and some people don't know if it's a good time right now to buy or sell. So I know there's a lot of uncertainty in the marketplace uh, for a lot of people out there. So I brought Ramos over here with me so he can explain what it is that he's doing because he's constantly putting houses in escrow, closing escrows. Um, he's putting a lot of deals together and helping a lot of buyers. So wanted to ask you, uh, first off, uh, how do you initially meet a buyer for the first time? Actually, I've just been doing a lot of cold calling, just reaching into past clients, referrals. Um, I do post a lot on my social media. Now I'm starting to post a lot just because we're, you know, we can't do open houses and stuff like that. So just trying to get a little bit more exposure and for people to see what I'm doing. Um, I mean, that's pretty much how I'm. Gotcha, gotcha. And then um, what are you seeing as far as buyers? Like when you first talk to them, uh, what's happening? Like, are they afraid to go see homes or like, what is their situation? That's not even the problem. Like they're, they, they, if they want to see a home, they will see a home. But the problem is they're just like thinking the market's going to drop or the market's mm. going to, they just want to know where the market's going to go after this whole pandemic. Thing. So what you're saying is most of it is like uncertainty as far as where prices are going to be in the next couple of months, year. Or right, so. right. They think because 16 million people lost their jobs, like the economy is just going to crash and stuff like that. I, Got it's it. gonna hit us hard. So got it. So well, basically, what are you doing to overcome that right now? Uh, I mean, there's still buyers out there. People are still buying and selling. So you just gotta you gotta hit the phones hard. Um, you just gotta be consistent at it and keep making appointments, keep setting up Zoom calls and stuff like that. Whatever Zoom works calls, for you. Yeah. I mean, that's the only thing we could do right now, just because we're limited to um, you know generating business right now with no open houses, but. Just phone calls, past clients, referrals, just try to get whatever you can you know, out of it. So, so you're able to do it, it sounds like. Mm -hmm. What about uh, when it comes to showing homes? Like what do you have to do? What's different about now than before when it comes to showing homes? I mean, obviously we have to be, you know, take precaution, uh, wear masks, gloves, mm -hmm. um, hand sanitizer has to be carried with you as well. Right. Um, I usually have I kind of open the doors for everyone. If, if I go show a home, I'll open the doors for the clients and stuff like that. So that way they're not touching and then um, I'll be the one touching everything, but I'll have gloves on, of course, yeah. so. Yeah. Wow, so you're on the front line. <laughs> you're doing all of it for them, right? Taking yeah, the risk. Yeah, 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 okay. of course, yeah. That's awesome, awesome. And I mean, then. I care about my health, but you know, I, I mean, I care about Care about the clients, clients too, so. right? Yeah, sorry, that's so. me getting another call. That's probably a client, I'll have to call them right back. <laughs> so uh, so it sounds like you're, you're able to meet with them over Zoom or in person, you wear mask, gloves, you do what it, it takes, and the buyers are still out there buying, the sellers are still out there selling, and it's just, the main concern right now is uh, what what's gonna happen with prices and and no one knows. Exactly. When someone asks you like, oh, I'm not sure what's going on in the market, what happens with prices, what what are you letting them know is uh, happening in the market right now? Um, so things that we do know, I mean, interest rates are still low, uh, about like 3%, 3.5%. Mm. Those are things we still know. Uh, people are still buying and selling. You just gotta, you know, go find them basically. Yeah. Um, but things that we don't know, like the whole pandemic, we don't know how long this is going to last. It could right. last another three to four months or maybe towards the end of the year. Yeah. I mean, we just got to focus on the things that we do know yeah. and try to use that as an advantage to, right. you know. Like low inventory. Right. The inventory is so low also because of the pandemic. So that's causing um, uh, there to be a higher demand for that small amount of properties in the market, which is causing prices to be high still. Yeah. And uh, at this point, we thought, basically prices may already come down and we're only seeing more and more competition build up, right? right? Especially out here where we do have a, still have a good, strong job economy, right? Mm -hmm. So that's awesome. Is there anything else that you could share with us basically about how, how you're able to get the deals done? Uh, I mean, you just gotta have a good team behind you. Obviously you have to work with the you know, number one team in Adult Valley. So that's I got awesome. a pretty strong, solid team behind me. So honestly, it's kind of, it, it's being there just um, with the team kind of just helps me keep pushing. So yeah, you just gotta for sure. keep getting calls, keep making your calls, keep setting appointments. Um, try to keep meeting people. I mean, if they, if they don't want to meet if they don't want to meet you, do Zoom calls, of course. Um, but there, there is buyers out there and just, you just gotta put in the work. 
Uh, make sure you guys just like, comment, share, subscribe, share with all your family. Yes, and, uh, hit that bell, hit that bell. <laughs> if you guys are realtors and you wanna see how we're doing it, make sure you subscribe so you can see exactly how we're doing this stuff. We're gonna keep making videos, we're gonna keep selling houses, we're gonna keep crushing it. If you are someone who wants to buy or sell a home and you need an expert, comment us, message us, subscribe to our channel because we have a lot of good videos that'll help you prepare your house, that will help you prepare to buy a house, all, everything encompasses around real estate. So let us know how we can help you. All right, man, well, so what, what I, gotta, I gotta get these texts, man. I've been, they've been waiting on me, bro. Oh, I gotta okay, go.